Hey guys, this is Michibi Maxon again. So, have you ever like reached on the website and like need to download all the images on it or at least on that page you're on but just can't go right clicking and saving every single image or maybe you just don't have the time or maybe you just even don't know how to save them because they won't allow you to. So I'm going to be showing you how to download like every single image on a page or any image, any images that you choose in this case. So to get started on doing this, uh, what you're going to need is going to be Google Chrome because obviously it's going to be a Chrome extension to be able to do that, to make things easy. This is cross platform. It works on Windows and even on Mac, but I'm going to be showing you on Mac because it's my operating system of choice. And I'll be downloading images from my website, uh, Fathom, Fathom.com. And it's probably <coughs> and it's probably a web design a web design company uh, that like does graphics design and all that stuff. So there is a lot of stuff to look at here. So you could just visit here and just check it out for yourself. It makes we do affordable web design, graphics design, like architectural 3D design a lot of stuff so you can come and check it out and we are hiring so if you have some skills like web design and graphics design you can contact you can leave your contacts here and just like request a contact back and i'll be contacting you myself or one of my like tech teams or support teams and at the contact page you can also contact from there uh you can if you like need a website and we do affordable websites great websites you can check out our portfolio here on this website uh, we do web design from around from 200 500 bucks depending on like your website the website you need so you can check out our default portfolio because some people are afraid that like low price services means like bad services that's not the case with us so you can check out our portfolio all our websites are high quality and let me just get back to the tutorial. I just don't want to dive in into this website because it's not the reason why we're here. So the extensions you're gonna need, the extensions, you're, the extension, yeah, just the one you're gonna need. It's called FatCan. Yeah, batch download, Dang it. download image, and it should also just come up here as a recommended. And it should be the first link here. Let's just click it to open it. And now let's just add it to Chrome uh, because it's just as simple as that. Add extension and checking. Dang, and there it's been added to our Chrome as you did see there. So I'm just going to quit this. Just going to come to Fathom and reload it. So it's not yet here. Okay, let's first enable it. Let's come here. More tools, extensions. And where it is? Where is it? I don't see it in my extensions. So there must be something obviously wrong. It didn't add somehow. So let's just add it again. Checking it has been added. Yeah, but why did it remove itself last time? So let's just come to the website. I'm just going to be downloading images on my website that I like. No, I own copyright too. So I highly recommend you do this on images. You own copyright too because this is like just showing you how to do it. I'm just not influencing downloading, downloading uh, images that you don't have full copyright on. So I'm just going to click here. And just click I want to save images on this tab. Not all tabs. If you have like tabs open and you click all tabs it will try to save images from all those tabs so I'm just gonna choose this tab and it should show the images that are there you can filter them by width so that it like just doesn't show up show all the icons and all that stuff so you can just make like a higher quality with it and a, like the height you can just customize by that so I'm just gonna leave my minimum width at 490 and it will show up the, it will bring up these images uh, there are some of our portfolios with design websites, book covers, 3D work. So I'm just going to save the image. Save the images. 
it will show you do not select a square to save file so if you like haven't chosen the default the default location where your chrome should like save your files it will just keep on asking where to save every single image so uh, we, i highly recommend coming to your chrome and choosing where your default your default uh, files should be saved and just click i know because mine is already configured just click save images save image and it should download the images and what i like about this this extension is that it creates a folder on your computer as you can see in my download it created a folder faith on your ultimate digital solution uh the slogan of the website so it will just take the title of the website and just create a subfolder there and just put in your images as you can see images have been downloaded successfully so uh i think this is pretty much it guys so thanks guys for watching if you like want to check out my website if you need a website or like have website and graphics design skills you can just go and contact me there through the website uh leave a comment down below for further questions uh leave comment leave recommendation of how tools you want to see and subscribe like the video and maybe i should show you further on the website yeah let me just show you a few portfolios of ours works or well, let me just come here and just choose full portfolio let me just show you a couple of here before you leave but you can leave now it's like the tutorial is over i'm just like continuing for the people who are interested in my website in our graphics design website. so we've done some graphics work design some let's let's first check this out some graphics work here the triangle as you can see we've done some graphics work we designed some of this book cover uh you should even check out this book it's pretty interesting uh some posters for her business cards and let's first go back here and we've designed shiba's website a directory website so shiba is like the biggest musician here in uganda and just being in uganda in general make you like gives us the ability to give uh, affordable services for like great outcomes and this is like my like my most favorite website of all we did put a lot of work into this and it came out exactly as we wanted it to and i'm pretty proud of it so this is the kind of work we do for our clients.